The Caran Dash Neo Color 2 15 Water Soluble Crayon Set. Hi guys, in this quick video we're going to take a look at what I'm classing as professional, budget friendly, if you live in Europe, watercolours. Let's go. Okay, so I was gifted these at Christmas and the lid opens like that. It's not, it is attached, it's not um, separate. You get this little in different language pamphlet and I've done a swatch card so you can see what the colours look like. And I've added actually um, some extras that I've purchased. So you've got the light yellow, you've got the orange, a dark orange, a red, a uh, you know, magenta -y, a purple, and you know, three blues, two greens, yellow ochre, a brown, a black, and a white. That is extra that I purchased, which is a Toledo brown. And I will say the browns, out of all the colours, are not as uh, smooth. They are a little bit drier, so you have to push a little harder. Not so creamy is the word I'm looking for. Now these were on sale on Amazon France for 18 euro, about 18.99. So under 20 euros in around November. You basically have to be a bit of an Amazon stalker and look throughout the day on Amazon when you're looking for budget art supplies. Because after um, the event, when we hit December, um, there was like, I think, after Black Friday. Uh, yes, so it was like 18.99 before Black Friday, before Black Sales and all the rest of it. And um, whatever you call it, you know, all these other sales that come, the price goes up at that point, I've noticed. So the key was to buy before any of these sales start happening. And so that's when we got the deal, because they then went straight up to about 27 euros, almost 30, for the same set on French Amazon. And so we got a good deal on this. And it's worth it, because... Each colour is light fast and each colour is a stick basically of pure pigment. There is some wax in it, obviously it's a wax pastel, but it's water soluble, which means it's all going to be light fast. And normally premium art supplies, you're paying for it being light fast and nice pigments. So you can see here, they are vibrant. It also will depend on the paper that you use. Now the Hanemule DNS sketchbooks that I'm currently really into and loving, really these colours come really vibrant on that paper. They weren't so as vibrant on the Fabriano drawing sketchbook. So I just wanted to share this with you just to let you know that these for if you live in Europe are in fact budget friendly now you do have to spend money um, you know if you're an artist and you, you need uh, premium supplies because premium are going to give you better results they do cost more so the key is to look around as I said before Christmas you need to look for um, products and brands that are native to your country and region. So if you're in America, Daniel Smith will probably be better value for you than these Caran d'Ache Neo colours because these Caran d'Ache are from Switzerland. So of course you've got the import cost and tax and all the rest of it. So for me this year, these are my budget friendly recommendations if you are a watercolour artist. This is all I'm using this year for my watercolours.
These are actually sold separately or individually on Jackson Art Supplies, which is where I've been purchasing my individual colours from. And my goal is to buy another set of 15 individual colours. So I'll have 15 here and 15 here. And then that will be my permanent palette that when I get low, I just have to buy replacement colours. Now they're not that durable. I have had some accidents where they've fallen on the floor and they've snapped in half. But you can still use them, they're just wrapped in paper. So you unwrap the paper and you still have the sticks of paint, like this. Just take the paper off and you can still use it. Perfect. And my yellow snapped. <laughs> but all usable. So this is an example of what I mean that you can achieve with the crayons. You can leave texture in here and it helps when I'm doing botanical, the flowers. It leaves that lovely vein texture. You can also build up the colour around here and they're opaque. So the more layering, the more opaque they'll become. And that's very good for around the centre of the flower. Remember, this is the Fabriano paper. And if you look at my Hanamule DNS sketchbook tour, you're going to see a difference. If you look at the artwork there, the vibrancy, and then you see this vibrancy. Paper makes the difference. And then you can see how the greens and the blues all work together. So I purchased a darker green and I then you I also I think a bright green or maybe grass green or something. So I mixed all of the four greens together. And by doing that, because with neo colours, you can uh, scribble them onto a palette, either the tin or ceramic palette or something, and pick up the paint with a brush. But really, it's a lot easier to have the individual colours that you scribble on and then you can smoothly blend it all together. That is the idea of them. So, there are lots of ways of using the Neo Colour and they're economical, they will last you a long time. Even somebody like me that is a prolific artist. So I hope this is giving you some ideas and that perhaps you will if you live in Europe, we'll discover some Neo Colours for yourself and see that actually they are cost effective and very good for your professional art supplies. Um, they're going to suit you well if you do watercolours all the time. I really liked how this came out. This is the Sunday meal that we have and that is the Yorkshire pudding. Didn't come out as perfect as I liked, it's a little bit rigid but the rest is recognisable. I just like that with the colour range you can get really realistic colours or you can get really fun non-realistic colours. It just all depends on what you wish to achieve. And the 15 colours are very versatile. I'm just adding because I'm using them all the time now the extra 15 is going to be for my perfect palette. And once I have all the 15, I'll be showing you the colours that I've chosen. And I won't be choosing any others after that. Unless I really don't like one of the colours. And then I can swap. So with that said guys, I'm going to catch you on the next video. Bye! Don't forget to hit the like button.